for our inspirations and goals, the stuff that makes us thrive in life, when we follow our dreams and the things that make us thrive in life, when we turn it into a hobbies or what we do for a living, when we do things that make us feel passionate and it brings and it makes us feel inspirational and brings uh, passion into our lives, our lives become a lot better and a lot more abundant. It's so big to remember that that voice up in our in our head that's telling us they're not good enough is based on our, our past experiences and it's not true. 95% of what we think about ourselves, if we're not practicing mindfulness and we're not aware, is from our past experiences. This is why so many of us walk around for so long thinking we're not good enough. Because we, we judge ourselves, we compare ourselves to others, and we think about things in the past that we've done to ourselves to harm ourselves or maybe hurt other people. It's so important to not live in the past, live in the past and to start a, t a new day today and for tomorrow and to forget about the past. I've gone through severe depression majority of my life. I've had major trauma happen to me. My father was killed in an accident and a lot of other things have happened. I suffered from severe depression for years. I no longer suffer from these things because I practice in manifesting mindfulness and I follow my uh, passions in life. When we get out, when we do the unknown, it's uncomfortable at first, but when we force ourselves to do something new and out of our realm and the possibilities are endless what happens when we do this. When we get out and we start living life to the fullest when we tell ourselves yes we can when we get out of our own heads when we are able to start being more aware consciously aware of the negative thoughts in our mind or any uh thing that's holding us up when we when we start venting to the ourselves or to someone else what's holding us back when we're able to get off the couch when we're able to coach ourselves to get outside in that fresh air, go for that little walk that's going to bring us a lot more joy and happiness. There's so much beauty in the world around us, and there's so much inspiration, and there's so many things that we can do in our lives. And when we're able to start figuring that out, we're able to start realizing what really matters is today and what we're doing. When we start following our passions it's so important to have passions and hobbies to get us out of bed. Stuff to look forward to in life. Things don't happen for us. They happen to us by the way we live our lives. When we start living our lives with more happiness and joy and with an open heart and we stop judging ourselves and other people, life starts to become so much more fruitful. I can't get across how important it is for us to all to start getting out of our own minds, getting out of our own ways. Because that's what holds us back is the way we think. When we stick to thinking positive and embracing new things and people, and when we switch things up and start being more open-minded and kind and giving to others, it brings so much more joy and happiness into our lives. And using gratitude is very big. Gratitude is huge. When we start being more grateful for things, being more grateful for what we have instead of what we don't have is when we end up with having more to be grateful for. I hope you have a great day. Please subscribe. Write to me if you have any questions. Um, take it easy. Bye.